Hi, this is Jennifer Donovan with 5minutesforbooks.com with a video review of The Wilder Life by Wendy McClure. Um, this isn't really going to be a straight review. You can check out my full review on 5minutesforbooks.com. This is uh, a few personal thoughts about why this book meant so much to me, and I'm going to share an excerpt with you that I think will show you why I love this book so much. So this is on page 302 of the ARC copy that I have. Um, and uh, Chris is her boyfriend. Back at home, Chris was reading Farmer Boy. It's officially the third book in the series, but I tend to think you can read it out of order since it's a standalone story. He said he wanted to have some idea of what I'd be seeing on my trip. One night, when I was still in New York City, I called home to Chicago. I don't get why you don't like Farmer Boy, he said on the phone. This book rules. This kid has like the best life ever. There's a donut jar in the kitchen. The donut jar really is cool, I admitted. In his right hand, he held a donut, and in his left hand, two cookies, Chris said. I knew then that he was reading from the book. He took a bite of a donut, and then a bite of the cookie. He was quoting the birthday scene where Almanzo gets to stay home from school and go sledding and wander through the kitchen, double fisting baked goods. That's some bad action right there, Chris said. Whatever, I said. You haven't gotten to the part where he says he can't wait until the 4th of July celebration where there will be speeches. What nine-year-old boy looks forward to speeches? Okay, so that's my little excerpt. Little funny, little irreverent, perfect example of why I loved this book. And the personal is right here behind me. The blue boxed set. And this is the same set that Winnie McClure was reading from. I don't think she owned it as a child. Um, but I did. I don't know how old I was when my grandmother gave them to me, but my name is written on the top in a horrible, scrawly cursive, so I guess I was at least in third or fourth grade. Loved these books. They are worn out, um, as you can see. And uh, my daughter did not love them. That makes me sad, sad, sad. So anyway, here with 5 Minutes for Books, this is Jennifer Donovan. Thanks again.